In this exercise, we'll implement the function greatest difference. The function takes two lists of numbers as arguments and returns the greatest absolute difference between numbers at corresponding positions in the two lists. It's assumed that the lists are of equal length and are non-empty. Let's look at the first sample execution. The function is called with two arguments, a list containing 1, 2, and 3, and a list containing 6, 8, and 10. To figure out what the greatest absolute difference is, we consider the absolute differences between elements at the same respective positions in both lists. The absolute difference between 1 and 6 is 5, between 2 and 8 is 6, and between 3 and 10 is 7. So between 5, 6, and 7, the largest absolute difference is 7, which is what the function returns. Similarly, in the second sample execution, the argument list is 1, negative 2, 3, and minus negative 6, 8, and 10. The absolute difference between 1 and negative 6 is 7, between negative 2 and 8 is 10, and between 3 and 10 is 7. Therefore, the function should return 10. Let's implement the function. We'll follow the same reasoning we used to figure out what the function should return for the sample executions. First, we must compute all the absolute differences between each pair of elements from corresponding positions in the two lists. Then, we'll find which of the absolute differences is the largest and return it to the user. To do so, we need to declare an empty list in which we'll store all the absolute differences. Now, to compute the absolute differences, we need to iterate over all the positions in the two lists. and compute the absolute difference between each pair of numbers, then append it to the list that we just created. Now that we've computed all the differences and have them all in the list, we can simply find the largest element in the list using the max function and return that from the function. Recall that the max function will find the largest element in the list. Now let's test our function. The first sample execution returns as expected. as does the second. 